What is up, everybody? I'm a killer. Wa I'm a killer Whaley, and uh, I'm doing a Minecraft tutorial video. You hear? I think you heard that. I'm gonna turn the sound down a little bit. We'll see how that works. All right. Well, as you can see, I can't get through it because there's not an actual door right here, but this is like a mob-proof door. And as you can see, I'm on survival, so this is easily built on survival. You push that button, you can get through right there. And right here, can't get through again. So you push the button, and you can get through right there. I just want to back out. So I'm going to do a tutorial on how to do this. So I'm actually going to switch my game. And this was this house was built on survival. I'm going to switch my game mode to creative. I'm going to fly out of here. I'm actually going to put this stuff in my inventory and take that off. And my skin is not Steve, just right now I don't have internet. Like, my dad's house usually has internet, but it went down. I don't know why it's lagging so bad. But, let's clear this area. Alright. So the stuff you're gonna need is a fence gate, any kind of fence gate. Um, you're gonna do a spruce, kind of like spruce. Uh, you're gonna need some redstone. You're gonna need carpet. Doesn't matter what kind. I just use light gray because it doesn't blend in all the way with the wool or with the stone, but it blends in a little bit. So this time I'm going to use light blue. You're also going to need the block that you want a, a button to. Don't forget the button. You, I'm going to use a wood button because I'm going to make this one out of wood. So I'm going to make this one out of spruce wood planks. Alright. So here's the general doorway. Right here. You're going to come through here. But what you want to do, you want to break the block, break one block, place a fence gate right there, shift, and right click to place your carpet on there, and as you can see, you cannot get over, but you're also going to want to break the block to the left or right, whichever side fits you better, you'll see the fence gate right there, you can open it, you can go through, and that's what the redstone is there for, so you're going to place one, uh, one little redstone dust right there, place the button right there you're gonna hit it, that's gonna power it and you're gonna be able to walk right through so and then you can just cover it back up with a uh, say podsel or whatever surrounding it press the button you can get through you can even do this on the same side it'll work I just did double doors because I like that better but see you can't get through it and this also works for uh, mobs they cannot get through. I'm gonna fence myself in here. And I'm gonna change it to night slash time set night. I'm going to uh, get a zombie egg. Yep. I'm gonna spawn it right there. I'm gonna slash game mode survival. And he'll come to the door, but he can't get through. If you get too close, he can hit you. But, like that, but he cannot get through. So this is a good thing to do if you, like, cover the top so spiders can't get in. If you just want to sit here and, like, get zombies or whatever mob to come over here. It's a good, like, mob grinder. But, uh, anyway, now just a quick little tutorial for you guys. I'm going to sign off right now. Let me switch my game mode back to creative, though. And I'm gonna fly away. I'm gonna leave that there. I'm gonna go back home. Hopefully, home is this way. Anyways, I'm gonna thank you guys for watching. Uh, stay tuned for the next episode. This is A. Killer Whaling. Peace.